I went to Dr. Marshall late today for a follow-up post-op, probably my second one, and she said, it's a lot better now. Of course, she put me to my nostrils and said they were 9% open, no, 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 95% open, whereas when I came in for the surgery, my right nostril, she couldn't even slide cotton in it, it was so locked up. And of course I came out feeling better, no longer feeling like I couldn't live, but yet feel, still feeling this blockage in my ear, something's blocking my ear, can't click like this and hear a clear click and down my right ear as I came my left ear. Now I know why. She said, some damage. Whether it was about the station tube but we hit myself like this. Something damaged my eardrum. The eardrum, she compared it to a rubber band. And she said, something happened. This caused the eardrum to stretch. It stretched so far that when it was let go, it could not go back to its original shape. Chris, you're going to have to live with this for the rest of your life. At least, thank you Dr. Marshall Lake, at least I know, I got what I wanted, answers. They, they can close the sheet, and they cannot fix this up. She did say, uh, they got some, some experimental things they're working on to try to correct it, but it's, they, but it's they, 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 but they've been trying for years, but it's not. They can't guarantee it will work. And your medical insurance won't pay for it, so we don't do it. She said, as, she, as, she, as if she couldn't even give it a damn about helping another human being out. If she needed something that could help it. I tell you, I'm not good looking enough. She doesn't care about me, because I'm old and ugly. If I was a good looking guy, she oh, screw it. But she said, Balloon dilation eustachian tube is what they're looking at now to correct what I got. And, this, and everything's coming together now. The reason why I do my exercises, my pushes, for that day, and the, day the day after, the congestion, the blocking in my ears is worse, but it gets better. But I've seen the congestion in my ears caused by my eardrum. Wow. That's basically it. I'm so traumatized with the fact that she did not give a damn about me as a person. Not just that means she didn't give a damn about me as a person, but why? Because I'm not a good looking guy. Because I'm just plain language, translation, ugly fucking guy. And I'm so old looking. I thank you, Dr. Brolis, for referring me to her. Now, Dr. Crowley doesn't care about me. She said she thought I looked 25. And she was really kindly, compassionate. She was both compassionate and wise. Dr. Marshall Lake, why can you have been both, of, both the same? You are an intimidating presence. You are an intimidated, intimidated, uncaring, unsympathetic, emotionally distant. And that's extremely offensive to me. Look how old I look now. Look how old I look now.